and now you have this fine show. Um, but yes, thank you so much to Viridian Row. They've provided us uh, quote T-shirts as well. We've won on we've worn here on the program. Um, my question to you that I had was, um, how do you feel about? Um, well, you have nieces and nephews, don't you? I have a niece. Yeah. Okay. I have a niece, but I have a lot of little cousins too. So there's yeah. lots of kids running around. I don't have any like like technically, I don't have any nieces and nephews or whatever. Mm -hmm. But um, I've been really um at that stage where I'm I'm um adoring when I have a friend that has a kid and they're like, oh, mm -hmm. you're you're Gunkle Ronnie. Like I right. think that is so freaking cute. And uh, so I'm at that stage where I'm like really moving into my my gunkleness. Yeah. Um, well, and I've had friends with kids and, you know, they one of what my one my best friend. I just made up Dallas, that word. She, <laughs> well, uh, well, not gunkle, but gunkleness. Yeah. Yeah. Her, yeah, yeah, yeah. her daughter came to spend a week with me in L.A. when she was like, uh, you know, 13, 14. And I was like, oh, my God, what am I going to do with this teenager? But mm -hmm. we ended up going to Disneyland and the beach and we did all the fun stuff. So I've kind of always had you know like kids around and um been i like having fun and, and doing kid things it's funny because kids always kids like me i had got accosted by a little kid at eight at the grocery store the other day that just was like following me around and just like laughing it's so <laughs> funny uh, and <laughs> not I, not me with what it, like it's got to be my my friends and family like if mm -hmm. you're just a like this was just someone you, uh, it was you just did like not know. Random kid. Oh, I was oh, like no, standing no. and he just like comes over. He no, has to be, he no, has to no. be like two, if that. Mm -mm, and mm -mm. he's like coming over with his parents and he's just like following me. And they're just like, they're not really understanding what he's doing. And I just turned around and I would look at him and I just said, hi. And I kind of like knelt down and got kind of yeah. face to face with him. And he was just like laughing. And then I was like, okay, bye. And then I like mm -hmm. walked off, but he kept following me. And like the parents are like, oh my gosh, she's like really into you. No. And I'm like, can you get your kid? Get your mangy kid with a snot nose away from me. <laughs> Parents of these types of kids and also dog owners. Now, don't get oh, sensitive because oh. you're a dog owner. <laughs> don't be a dog owner or a, 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 like, you know, have your little kid and assume the assumption. I guess this is more of a dog thing than a kid thing. But the assumption that I want to engage with your mangy mutt, that's an hey. assumption. But what if I don't like dogs though? What if I got bit by a Rottweiler? Mm -hmm. you do, but do you hear what I'm saying? I'm yeah, not saying no to that. dogs. I think they're cute. But mm -hmm. because so many people, when you walk your dog, they're like, oh, your dog is so cute. And they're always talking with you. Mm -hmm. Well, when your dog starts sniffing on the person and the person is me and mm -hmm. I give you a side eye and a <laughs> know that that means get your freaking dog away from me and stop <laughs> assuming that I like it. I got bit by a Rottweiler. And I had 16 stitches in my hand. So Ooh. I'm not exactly okay mm -hmm. with the mm -hmm. mangy mutt. Well, then don't come near me when I've got my dog. No, but it's the it dogs coming near me. Oh, me. my. Now, you're trying to tell me I got across the street because the dog. Across oh, the street. This one is a four-time dog owner. So we're just going <laughs> to abort this sentence in this conversation because she's she going to defend her dogs. You know I made a good point. You know no, I made you a do. good point. No, you, you do. And, know. I, and honestly, like I, I don't appreciate that either. It's I, I try not to let my dogs do that. I always kind of, you know, try to keep them at a close rein when there's other people walking by because you don't know. You don't know if people are allergic to dogs, if they're scared of dogs, you know, whatever. Or especially if it's muddy or raining, I don't want them jumping up on people and getting them dirty because that's just not cool. So oh, I do try to be point. respectful of that. And I know that you are good. I was a dog <laughs> sitter of two of your dogs. <laughs> yeah. Um, I always bring it up like I, <laughs> I won the award. Yeah. No, but I will say also the thing about the dog yeah you don't know what the personal experience is right. so if it's a little 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 tinier dog i guess it's a little more okay and mm -hmm. it is cutesy or whatever but don't assume that because seven people you walked you know you walked your dog you know in the neighborhood seven people had like said oh they're cute they're cute they're cute and they touched them and licked them or whatever people do to strange dogs i would never <laughs> i would never uh, please don't lick my dog <laughs> <laughs> I know, like, get away from her dog, yeah. No, but for, for me, it's like, you know, because I got bit by the Rottweiler, I'm not very, like, comforted with mm -hmm. the dog unless unless mm -hmm. you kind of tell me or I know. Suddenly the dog's, like, um, jumping up on me, licking me, messing up my pants, you know, like, yeah, you know, <laughs> Yeah, I try not to, I try not to do that. Especially because with my <laughs> new really, dog, like, he's I really, a just really... Do a Yes, you did. He's a really big dog. So I took him trick or treating <laughs> and little kids were kind of running up to him and I was kind of holding him back and I would tell parents, you know, hold on, like, 
you know, he's friendly, but I don't know how friendly he is. So watch your kid, you know, don't. Right. That's too. It no could be a liability for you. Dogs. Like, mm -hmm. that's, that's a bad look for any parent. Never mm -hmm. just let your kid run up to a dog. Even if they look nice, they might not be nice. Listen, so. if I see a dog coming up to me unwanted, the first look that I have is this. <laughs> Shock <laughs> and awe. <laughs> Get away well, back from to me. the holidays. Okay, so tell me, um, <laughs> what is your? Uh, are there any new holiday movies out that you've watched this year? No, I haven't really um, did followed you watch them. The Lindsay Lohan movie? On no, Netflix? I did not. I probably what? will not. I think that I'm getting a little more. I think we're getting a little out of hand with, like, there was a brand of like the the Hallmark movie or the Lifetime movie, 